But it comes in Spanish. <laughs> we got spiny, and it's in, thank you, gracias. You get Chinese food, and it has a bag that says gracias. Yes. Gracias. Mexican. Gracias. What's the Mexican? That's a Mexican. For thank you. What would be thank you in Chinese? Aso, thank you. Now you've heard an unboxing. This is an on bagging. Bad, bad. Bad. Leakage. We've got some, what are those? Those are wontons. Wontons. Um, cheese wontons. They don't quite weigh oh, a ton. You don't good. have to open them. Oh yeah, you want to see these. These are good. You don't have to. Crab Rangoon. Okay. That's one ton. Oh, Crab Rangoon. Crab Rangoon. Alright. I believe that's white rice. White rice. White rice. This is a this sweet, is sauce, sweet and sour red sauce. Red stuff. It's red. Fortune cookie. Fortune cookie. You will get lots of money. Egg roll. Egg roll. Hot, hot, hot. This would be yours. This is hot and spicy beef. Let's pop the lid off here. Ooh. And uh, see what we got. Look at that. Yummies. Looks pretty good. I always like to put this hot mustard sauce on it with some soy sauce. Get pork fried rice. And what'd you get here? This is uh, shrimp and scallops and garlic sauce. Shrimp and scallops and garlic sauce. Now oh, that looks pretty good. That's what leaked. It leaked. I might have to take a taste of that. You can so. try that. All right, this is our Chinese dinner. It's a uh, feast to behold. Now I wanted to show you these orange blossoms. They're just getting ready to blood out. They're still, uh, you know, capsulated in. To, they haven't popped open yet. You can. Uh, I start to smell them. Oh my gosh, they have such a, the best smell. It, uh, it's about right end of February, and orange blossoms start coming out. We'll uh, take some other. Here's a here's one up here. It's opened up. It's opened up. Try not to touch them because they fall off really easy. Each one of those will be an orange, the ones that don't fall off. So uh, let's see what the lemon tree looks like over here. All right, here's the lemon tree. Notice they're a different color than the orange tree. They got like a, uh, a blue, or kind of a purplish look to them. There's quite a few of them. Last year I uh, got three lemons off. But it looks like they might uh, do a little bit better this year. But, uh, we'll keep looking these over as they start blossoming out. The smell will be great here. This little tree is like a little oak. Um, it's uh, already kind of done and done. It's a little blossom. Um, oak leaves kind of push off the leaves and bring new ones right back on. I'm to figure what this hole is. You see it's been dug out here. I don't know, it doesn't look like it's been used. Um, I would be guessing probably armadillo. But I don't know, it don't exactly look like nothing's been in and out of there for a while. So I would guess it's an a, abandoned armadillo hole. This is like a wild weed though, but there is actually a flower on it. It's pretty cool. Some of these wild plants get some really nice looking flowers in here in the spring. Ah, uh, there's Cassie. She likes to have her picture up. And we're watching. What is this guy? Living free. We're watching him with his dog. Could Cassie be a living free dog? I don't know. Oh, it's such a beautiful day out today. We're uh, a little windy. I put the muff on the mic. I don't know if it's coming through or not. It's a good test of it. But yeah, it's just uh, beautiful. It cooled down just a little bit. We've been in the mid to upper 80s, and uh, it uh, today is probably let's say the upper 70s. Had a little little short little cold front come through. Cold fronts means it's only in the uh, 70s instead of the 80s.
Yeah, I've been uh, looking at the orange blossoms. We did a little video of that here this time, and uh, they're coming along. They smell good, man. You just can't believe the uh, the smells you get from the orange orange blossoms. They're uh, they're really cool. I thought I would uh, just sit outside here a little bit and uh, talk about. Uh, well, I'm I'm getting a new chair for my office uh, desk, and uh, came from uh, Walmart, and uh, it actually was delivered out of California. Talked about this this morning in my uh, uh, morning uh, coffee chat, and uh, I've been waiting for it to come in. It's crazy how uh, this is coming from FedEx. And uh, FedEx is uh, taking a route. It come from California and made its way across, came to Apaca, Florida. And Apaca is not too far from here. And then it went to Orlando, which is the opposite direction. And then it came back to Longwood, which comes back towards this direction. And now it's going to come over here to Deland. It took an extra like three to four days after it got in Florida to get here. That's crazy. Uh, it's just crazy, so anyways, we're going to wait on a chair. We're getting some new neighbors across the street. We've had more neighbors here, and right next door, uh, about a couple months ago, some people moved in. I think that was actually more than a couple months. It was during Thanksgiving. They moved in, and uh, so, uh, and they got a couple big, loud, noisy dogs that they leave out most of the time. So now across the street, uh, we uh, Big old motorhome pulled in about six o'clock in the morning. Actually, it was towed in on a big wrecker, and uh, they pulled it in the backyard. There was a, a pickup truck with a huge trailer on it. So uh, didn't even know this house was for sale. It looks like they're moving in, and uh, the lady that's lived there for quite a few years must not be there. So either she sold it or she's renting it. I'm not sure what's going on with that. But it's been busy across the street, uh, them unloading things, and they've been parked halfway out in the road. The road's been halfway blocked for the last two days, but uh, they're, uh, I guess, settling in. I've seen a uh, uh, satellite truck was over there, possibly getting satellite TV, and uh, seeing a, uh, it's fun watching neighbors. I don't know about you all, but I kind of like watching neighbors. It just kind of gives me something to do. Maybe somebody goes, well, you have too much time in your hand. Yeah, not really. That's what retirement's about. Relax and enjoy yourself. I thought I would chat on a little bit about. So hey, I uh, we had some good Chinese the other day. I showed you uh, a little clip of that here at the beginning of this video there. It was really good. I like this. Sue got something different. She got the, uh, uh, had scallops and it had uh, uh, shrimp in it. Now I, I taste it. I didn't care much for it. She liked it. She thought it was really good. I get this spicy hot beef that I really like a lot. And so uh, it was really good. We, that's what you need on that for two meals. You get plenty there when you uh, uh, order from Chinese. So uh, yeah, I hope uh, hope you enjoyed today's video. We've just been messing around here, hanging around the house. Uh, I'll have to go out and do some more uh, traveling around videos again. We're going to be going out uh, this weekend to a FPV meet. It's a CFL FPV. It's a radio control thing. That you know, watch my channel a lot. I do a lot of those. So we'll take some videos with that. Hey, if you enjoyed today's video, uh, give us a thumbs up. We like our thumbs up. And uh, if you're not subscribed, hit the subscribe button. Um, you know, this way you, uh, doesn't cost you nothing, you know. Hit the subscribe button, you'll uh, be notified when I get to uh, uh, put up a new video, which is almost every day, but uh, uh, you know, you'll keep track of it that way. And it'll help me out by hitting subscribe. Appreciate it. Appreciate all my subscribers. Uh, uh, they're all great. So uh, we're gonna get off of here and uh, I hope you enjoyed the video. We'll see you the next time.